Hello everybody and welcome to yet another episode with Jack Phelan Jeep Dodge Chrysler Ram with your host Mr. Hollywood. Today we have the 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit 4XE. Now the 4XE means it's a, it's a PHEV vehicle, meaning it does run off electric and gas at the same time. So you get the best of both worlds. You get better efficiency, you get the power, the instant torque of electricity, but you also have gas. So that way, if you don't have a charging station and you need to keep driving, you can always put gas in it. Now, what I love about the new Grand Cherokee is that new face is redone and it looks so aggressive, looks so mean, looks so beautiful and refined at the same time. You see in this one, in the white color, it's beautifully finished. You have a nice LED light up top. You have your nice bright lights. You have your nice finishes and trims everywhere throughout and your chrome highlights to really show that this is a luxury vehicle because as the name implies, the Summit is the summit, it's the peak, it's the cream of the crop, it's the best you got out there, right? So what they've also done is they've redone the key fob to make it slimmer, smaller, still has all the buttons, still has remote starter and everything, but it now easily fits in this extra little pocket of your jeans if you have them, right? So it's easy to pull out and access. You do have your plug-in power right here for the electricity, for the gas on the same side but in the back, and you do have the nice beautiful finish of a black highlight on the roof, and side panels as well as the mirrors that way you can truly see that that uh, contrast popping out and making it nicer now for keyless enter and go you do have the key fob in your pocket all you have to do is walk up to the car put your hand through the door handle and it will unlock to lock it there's little three ridges right here that might be hard to see but when you put your finger over them the vehicle will lock to unlock it you simply put your hand through the door handle you don't actually have to press anything Okay, as shown in this video, this vehicle is a $74,390 MSRP. It does have a 2.0 liter engine with a direct injection turbo. So it does have a lot of power. Now, yes, you heard that right, 2.0 liters. It's a four cylinder. In a truck like this, because of that electric and optimization, you get the best of both worlds. You get the efficiency and you get the power and torque that you need. Let's show you the rear of it. Hi, look at the nice rims as we're going past them. The rear has been also redesigned to look a little sleeker, a little nicer, really mimicking that Grand Wagoneer look a little bit, that Wagoneer look a little bit where it makes it really, 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 really nice. I think that really shows you that they're looking at the design and making sure that vehicles are pretty, pretty to look at, pretty to drive at and feel nice. You have two exhaust tips in the back to really show that the vehicle looks nice, to really make it more sporty, more efficient and all that. You also have your sonar sensors, your chrome highlights, and your little cover for the tow hook if you would like to tow something. Now, for this one, you can open it with your key. You can open it with a button on the door. But my favorite way to open it is with a nice little kick, right? Now, I'm not actually going to kick the vehicle. I'm just going to wave my foot like a kick in front of it to open and close. Say I have a box I want to put something in, I can do that, okay? You do, of course, have your little nice cover, your mat for the back, for the trunk. But if you look at the trunk space here, what you will see is you have... Your spare tire in here, a little bit of a storage bin, and your charging toolkit that you need to charge the vehicle up. They do think about everyone, which means if you like nice sounding music, there is a subwoofer in the back. If you like tailgating, there's a power outlet right here to let you go ahead and have maybe you're tailgating, maybe you're at a sports game, you want to plug something in, a radio, a speaker, charge it. And you also have the height of this, right? I understand people that are like five foot one or five foot two, they might not be able to reach that. So the button's actually not here. The button's right here. But by holding it, you can customize where it will open to. So you can have it customized to your height if you want to, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and close it. And then we're gonna hop on the inside and show you the interior. But first, let's show you the back seats which are also very, very nice. Now you will notice this one just came out of the factory, so it's still got all the foil on it, okay? I wanna show you the highlights and trims in the back that we have here, okay? So this is a Macintosh sound system, which we'll talk about more when we're inside, but I wanna highlight, they've done this in nice plastic so it doesn't tear, so your kids can kick it if you have kids. You have nice diamond stitching to really highlight the luxury of this vehicle. You have a nice full glass panel on the roof, and for the back seat, you have a full wall plug. So if your kids want to charge their iPad, they absolutely can. Two USB plugs, two USB-C plugs. So there's no fighting over the outlets. Controls for heating and cooling in the back right here. 
if you have a responsible adult, of course, and even heated seats in the back. Yes, people in the back no longer have to be cold. And what I really like about the Jeeps is that you do have this beautiful, beautiful seat. It's comfortable, it's roomy, and it's truly, truly amazing that you can really sit nicely in this vehicle. Now, also, they do fold down these seats. I always forget where they put the little buttons for that. But these seats do fold down that way you can go ahead and have them folded and you have more storage in the back. And it's actually right over here. See, that folds down. But what I want to highlight is they also thought about it. So there's two positions for seating, right? So I can sit like this up or I can lean back a little bit. So even if you're in the back, you can have a little bit of lean in your seat. You'll see the difference when I step to the other seat, right? You see how this one's straight up. This one's a little bit down. So you can do that. And of course, fully fold all the way down to make it a nice flat, even surface for plenty of storage. But let's not talk about the back too much because you as a driver will be spending most of your time in the driver's seat. Let's show you all those beautiful features on the interior of this beauty. I'll see you on the inside. So welcome to the interior of the 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit 4XE. You will see interior redefined. You have nice wooden finishes that really highlight the luxury. The orange stitching to, to highlight how beautiful really it is. The power button for the battery, traction and lane controls, parking sensors, automatic park, which I'll show you in a minute here. Navigation already on board, but of course you have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto and a 10.5 inch touchscreen to really make use of all this extra space on here, right? You have your home button, which allows you to customize the widgets you have. You can have map and music on one side. You can also put your uh, climate controls on here, suspension controls, schedule summaries, whatever you want, plenty of widgets, music, Sirius FM, FM, AM, all that stuff. And this is a Macintosh sound system, meaning it really has power. It can really play some serious tunes. Now, for YouTube's rules and regulations, we cannot play any music in here because they will cut us out immediately and ban us. So we're not going to do it. But you have to trust me that when it comes to sound, if you look at those speakers right there, if you don't know what Macintosh is, they are a leader in sound system design for luxury homes. So when they brought it into a vehicle, you know it's got some serious power. For climate controls, you have plenty of controls to choose from. You have your front, your rear, you can really control it, and and heated and ventilated front seats, which are controlled here. Also a heated steering wheel, and you have massage options. If you wanna get a massage while in the car as you're driving, you can simply turn it on, choose the setting, choose the type of massage, and you're driving, the seat's cooling you, and at the same time, you're relaxed, you feel that pressure just come off your back. It's really, really, really worth the investment. You have the storage here where you have two USB plugs, USB-Cs and regular plus aux, but you can close this out if you want to have a little bit less visibility for the cables. You will see we still have foil on here. We're not going to take it off because we want to keep the car clean for you. But you also have the option here of the park rear neutral and drive with a nice little shifter knob, and you can change the height of the vehicle. So this has what's called an air system that allows you to lower and increase the height of the vehicle at leisure. So you can actually increase how tall it is by holding it up and it will rise itself up or you can lower it down if you want it closer to the road. It will also do this automatically as you're driving and for what? To make you either more aerodynamic or more off-road focused. So you can have that completely done there, right? You, everything's nicely finished and nicely done. Steering wheel is nice and beautiful leather with a four spoke design. You have your paddle shifters on the back plus your volume controls. You have your automatic cruise control, which does come with the distance separation. So you can actually choose to follow somebody in front of you and it will stop, slow down and speed up depending on what's in front of you. So that's really cool. Up there, you have your battery charge for your electricity. So you can see how the charging is going from the outside and two cup holders with nice illumination lights. You won't see because it's light outside right now, but they're there, I promise you. And of course, Nice big storage, two level, with one level right here, second level below that, with plenty of space and storage. Nice glove box as well. But you're probably excited to see what is the self-parking feature. So, I know many videos don't show that, so we're going to actually show that to you. I'm going to give my cameraman a chance to put on his seatbelt so he can be safe, because we're going to put our lives into the hands of the machine today. Now, I always trust this, so I promise you it's going to be great. 
but I want to put I wanted him to put his seatbelt on because otherwise he's gonna beep at you, and you guys know that's not fun to hear. So to park anywhere. Now we have a nice parking spot. I see right there. It will do. It will do both parallel and to, and to the other parking. I always forget the word parallel and perpendicular parking for you. There we go. But what we're gonna do first is we're gonna find a parking space or a parking line. We're gonna press the parking button, the parking on, and we're gonna choose the function parallel, perpendicular, or parallel park exit. We're gonna do, do per perpendicular. As we're driving, we can choose which direction we wanna park in. So if we turn a turn signal, it will go the other way. If we turn a turn signal to the right, we'll go this way. It even tells you to use a turn signal to change sides. Right, now as we drive, it will measure the space for us and see if we will fit in there. So I actually have a space right there and I'm hoping that it will see it and it's big enough for it to fit there. But it looks like it determined that it's not big enough, but it did find, oh, it found a space, tells me to stop. Now I do have to control the gas pedal and the brake, but it gives me the instructions. Remove hands from wheel and shift to reverse. We're gonna shift to reverse, let the brake pedal go and let the vehicle do its magic. You see how it's turning the steering wheel on for you by itself. I'm literally not doing anything and I promise you I did not graduate from Hogwarts. So I have no magic in me, right? I'm gonna get as close as possible I can continue till the car tells me to stop, but if I don't feel comfortable, I can stop right here, turn into drive, and the vehicle is going to make its mathematical readjustments and change it for me to pull forward for me. Again, it will tell me to stop. See, it tells me to stop, but if I didn't feel comfortable, I can stop earlier. Then it, I will hit it to reverse again, and it will do the rest for me, doing an amazing parking job. Okay? So if you never want to have to worry about if you will fit in a parking spot or not, this will do it both ways, parallel and perpendicular, and it will do it for you in a perfect fashion. But even to both cars, we have space to exit and enter. It does a better parking job than me. I know we're often hesitant, don't trust the machines, we've watched the Terminator movie too many times, right? You worry the Jeep is going to try to kill you. I promise you, the Jeep is going to make your life so much easier when you're trying to park, okay? And let's look at this beautiful roof panel here because I didn't show it to you from the back. You have the cover. It doesn't slide. It's it's power, so you control how it is. Look at this beautiful glass panel. Do you see this? the sunroof? Do you see the sky? see the beautiful clouds? It's really an all-in-all -all luxury vehicle at a price of a regular SUV. So you're really getting all these awesome features for such a great value that simply passing up on the Jeep Grand Cherokee Summit 4XE is not something you can afford to do. You need to do it. You need to get into one. You need to know how it feels. I'm literally sitting in the car getting a massage right now. You cannot beat that, okay? I'm feeling it. I'm feeling relaxed, and I love it. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. We want to hear from you. Put everything in the comments, any questions you may have, and call the number appearing on the screen. Ask for Sebastian if you want to set up an appointment to see one in person, to touch it, feel it, to get a massage in the car. Or if you want to order one online, we'll deliver it to your door. We do deliver to all 50 states and we offer no BS pricing even in this crazy market environment. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a good one. Mr. Hollywood, out.